Now, um, this is not a hour of the day. This is a presentation. This is a a commendation video. This is a video jet. Now, I started with this particular song, this Pentecost um, or Pentecost uh, praise song because I'm coming to talk about the Church of Pentecost. And they've been trending since yesterday for the good reason, not for the bad reason. Please don't get me wrong, you understand? I am impressed with the way the Church of Pentecost are going about. I don't know if, it, if it's social, corporate, no, it's not a corporate social responsibility, but their dedication to serving the people of Ghana. It's amazing. It's, it, it just bust my mind. Now, um, uh, when I saw this particular news on their social media platforms with pictures and all those things, um, it, it bust my mind. This morning, of course, you know, say Ghana, there, everything, people will have issues to talk about it. Like, yeah, I mean, freedom of speech in India. <laughs> some people, they will take them my own away because, but anyway, um, they shared pictures of the projects that, uh, the project that they have undertaken in Charlie, my Boston. But before I even go talk about that, I want to give you people some background analytical membrane of how they have, they, they have used their platform or the Pentecost Church as, as, as an institution or organization. They have helped Ghanaians. Now, you people remember um, the pandemic. Then, Charlie, as the pandemic came, we, we didn't know, like, it, it came boom. Everybody was surprised. We didn't have the facilities. We didn't have the nose masks, the gloves. We, people, rich people and all those things. Organizations have to contribute and all those things to make sure, say, okay, we supplement the government. The Church of Pentecost, First of all, the Pentecost Convention Center uh, was, was turned into an isolation center for COVID-19 patients. That is what the church did when the COVID-19, when our numbers started uh, uh, skyrocketing. They decided to uh, 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 give their convention center to serve as what? Isolation center. They didn't finish their own. They don't finish for their self food. They also donated the Church of Pentecost donates logistics to Ministry of Health to combat coronavirus. And you see, they have been, it, it be my Boston. And that is what the church is supposed to be doing. I mean, I'm not here to uh, 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 tell your pastor how you should spend the offered tree money or the tithe money or the collection and all those things. But see, the Church of Pentecost, man, my Boston. And this was during the pandemic. Now, it got to a point. Uh, News um, broke out, said uh, they, are, they are going to build a prison, you understand, and hand it over to the Ghana prison service. People came, people um, people disagreed with the whole concept of the church building what um, prison for the Ghana prison service. So when the news broke, um, this is what KSM said. Let me let me read it to you. Quick question team is on Twitter. Pentecost church to build new prison, got to love GH. The government builds a cathedral and the church builds a prison. Only in Ghana. No, this makes sense. The government that we have voted, you, first of all, have you been to the prisons before? I have had, uh, no, I know because I go steal something with the carry me go put for there. It was just one of those visits. I have been to someone before and bro, bro, you don't want to be there. You don't want to go there. Bro, I want to tell you this, I do. You have to sit down. And watch your colleague to sleep, so that the next three minutes, you no know, ten minutes, you no know, so, so, no about that or no about sure. So, see, bro, people are going through it. People are going through it. But you see, the government would prefer to what build a cathedral instead of trying to decongest our prisons. The government would build a. Uh, 
cathedral instead of uh, decongesting the prison, like expanding the prisons and all those things. So yes, this particular tweet, they make sense. I mean, people go figure, say they attack the church, but it they make sense. I mean, if you're a citizen and you just say, ah, your, your, your government is trying to build a cathedral. The church, the church, you know, Nyankopuwa church is not building a cathedral. They are building, they, are, they have decided to build prisons, but the government is building cathedrals. You see the irony and all those things. You know, they make sense. So I understood uh, KSM's point. Then I see, um, if, if, you are, if you are familiar with gospel songs in the country, you will know this particular man, one of the most respected gospel producers and gospel artists we have in the country. Now see, so, what is that voice? Now just said, your man, they can't spoil the beats be that. Now, this was his opinion. In my candid opinion, it is wrong for a church to build a prison in Ghana instead. I would rather suggest that the church should build factories and create jobs for the for its members and other people to get gainful source of uh, gainful source of employment. In addition to the jobs, the church should teach, interlace it with good and practical Christian doctrines to help their members stay away from social vices, which may lead them into prison. I can tell you that some of the people who end up in prison might be due to joblessness, but some of our churches rather invest monies they get from the contribution of members in ventures that do not uh, inure to the members' benefits. It is sad. Um, it is said that the devil finds work for the idle hands. Okay. So now, see in opinion, we say instead of building the prisons, uh, the church for build uh, maybe factories and all those things. So see in church members there, then will get jobs too. So so, so see they no go end up. Uh, doing those social vices and I mean ending up in the prisons and all those things. Perfectly makes sense what they are saying. Now this, I mean, these two people made their opinions known about the whole prison thing and this was in 2000 and, uh, 2018, uh, let me see, um, this was when, oh, I think 2018 or something like that when they announced that they are going to go to prison. Now seeing point, it makes sense, you understand. KSM point that makes sense. Now fast forward, the Church of Pentecost they have handed the bro. Put it. Let, if you see the oh god, you go bust your mind. Let me let me. This is a presser on their website. Uh, the Church of Pentecost commissions uh, a drug camp prisons. A multi-purpose prison facility funded and constructed by the Church of Pentecost at the Jura in the Ashanti region has been commissioned and handed over to the Ghana Prison Service. The facility described as one of a kind in the country was constructed at the cost of. 3 million plus Ghana cities. The fully furnished three dormitory blocks with a capacity to um, accommodate 300 inmates also comprise an administration block, chapel, with, uh, which will also serve as classrooms, football pitch, baptistry, modern washrooms, mechanized boreholes, offices, infirmary, workshops, and other auxiliary facilities. Facilities, sorry was jointly commissioned by the Interior Minister, Honorable Ambrose Derry, the Chairman of the Church of Pentecost, Apostle Eric Yamiche, and the Chief of Ejura, Berima Osei Shedier II, did that. Speaking of the event which took place at the, on Tuesday, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so basically, they have handed the project. When they said they were going to build a prison, they built it. And they have handed the facility to the Ghana police, uh, sorry, Ghana prison service. Bro, when you look at the pictures, the facility, my Boston, man, my Boston. And this is why they talk. You see, they, they didn't just build a prison, they built a prisoner. Oh my, if you see a specific aspect, a bit enhancing vocational aspect of human beings, what they are saying. We have pictures, you know, who say like there is a rumor, uh, the sewing machines and all those things. When people are in prison or when people are jailed and they go through the system like that and they come out with no and Sanujuma and all those things, do you not get tired of those things? Because when they go in and they come back with no and Sanujuma, some of them just end, they go back to the street or wherever they started it and go back again. So in the course of doing this, you know, they are creating employment in there. They have, look, look at the facility. The vocational skills near there, they, they can teach people and all those things. And look, compare this to the 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 the, 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 the traditional uh, uh, prisons that we have. Look at the, the way they have arranged the beds. Look at the I mean ventilation and all those things. This is what the church is supposed to be doing to help mankind. This is the point of the church. 
I'm not saying it's sorry, I'm going to prison. But the other way, the means a bit more making sure say the the, the church, you know, the, 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 we see say right now the perception about the church is a case, 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 case. But look at what the Church of Pentecost they have done. And this morning, when you go online, people are angry now. Why are they using their money, uh, church money, to build prison instead of just a country? You know, you people think say what the development of this country is based on factories, 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 factories. Everything is supposed to be factories for you people. And you know, it makes sense to me. This is to help decongest. You people go on before. You weep. This is to help decongest. 300 capacity. And this is why I am dedicating this content to commending the Church of Pentecost. This is an amazing feat and it should be commended by every, every right-thinking citizen in this country. And if there's church with limited resources, they are able to do this, then the government should be ashamed of it. Of it, or what how do I qualify the government? It or him or her. The church with limited resources, with four of a trinitite, with what they let's say donor uh, grant in this annual money crack and one. Look at what a church, the church of Pentecost, they have been consistent with, with, with some of these things. This is a church, they don't how many taxes. I'm on your toes. I'm on your VAT. I'm on your income taxes. Look at what the church has been able to achieve. And the priority of the government is to go and build a cathedral. When the church that is supposed to build a cathedral for God, they are building prisons to do congest. They are building prisons to make sure that the, the people in the prisons, when they come out vocational skills near their day, bro, what kind of deprioritized country are we living in? People are allowed to have an opinion, but you see, I, I mean, I, I look. This, let me tell. Let me read something to you. Someone, someone tweeted this, and let me read it to you. Let, let me. I'm disappointed in people. You understand? But Ghana here, it be like everybody get opinion, and that is that would be the, the the problem. The church has a university, built hospitals, over 50 senior high schools, many basic uh, schools, but it is a prison camp aimed at giving people second chance in life. You are mad about. The Church of Pentecost, no, they have built hospitals, they have built universities, they have built schools, basic schools. But building what? A, a, a rehabilitation camp for our uh, uh, our people in the prisons. You know, so I don't be able to that. Master, you see, uh, the concept of prison is to rehabilitate people. You understand? You will be rehabilitated near the now, but you will be But here, when they put you in, it is punishment. You are you you they go inside, go break. And that is the situation of our prison uh, service in this country. So if a church has talked it twice, said no, you're caught, you're caught with trauma, near caught energy drinks, no coma. We see the, the state that they are in. The, the prison set, the prison, the, the, the rooms that they are in probable state. So make we build, make we build a facility that would accommodate 300 people with uh, spaces for vocational and all those uh, vocational skills and all those things. Uh, at least 300 people with me fast system number out. Would they want 300 people no crown on me now as as change people now? Would they 10 people crown on me in your face system? No, remember, I bet contribute to 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 the to 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 to. This is why I am commending the Church of Pentecost. And I'm see more, all ch churches in a more country, and I hope you are looking at it. And yet every day, Kofiniama, Abnani Kodjo, Kodjoni Akosia, Akosia ni Ata, Sana Diachi. Look, look at your mates. Look at your mate. Do they have two heads? I am not here to incite anyone against anyone. I am not the one who tell your pastor how you for spend the money uh, in church money and all those things. But these are some of the things. These are some of the things. The little things that we do, you know, they make we love you more. So I shout to the Church of Pentecost. And I just even change my church, you know. I'm Pentecost for I'm from I change because this is what I want to see. Brilliant initiative. 
shouts to the leadership of the church, the church members, you should be proud. If you attend this church and you see the pictures circulating on social media, you should be proud of yourself. You should be proud of yourself because your church is contributing. This is fixing the country. This is a practical example of fixing the country. Nanko fought it to social media. Then why is the church building a prison? Mr. Freedom of Speech, ne? And then Pastor Sam may be rebel guy now. Obia saw your opinion. Obia saw your oh. And Pastor your opinion, Obia no ya beto. You don't understand why a church is building a prison. And you say prison, so they are going to make money from it too. They built the thing with their own money, handed it to the Ghana police. Uh, why do I keep saying Ghana? Ghana prison service. Mufa. And you are mad. Oh, sorry, I know. But we need here. Come on, We got to be serious. This is a practical epitome. It is, this is an epitome of fixing the country. And I'm happy. I'm just happy. I, when I say, the facility be nice. Only prison of crying no court. This is like a, a structured dormitory with bed bunks and all those things. You are not happy. What kind of witchcraft is that? Shouts to the, the Church of Pentecost. Me see, they have been doing them since the COVID thing, you know, and I'm sure I said they've been doing it before even the COVID thing. They they do, they donated the, an entire what convention center for 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 what. Uh, 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 isolation to, to be turned to an isolation center. We church do some of these things. I'm not I'm not pitching any church against anything, no. but I'm just saying, say, this church is gradually trying to contribute to making sure say, the welfare of the citizens, its church members, Ghanaians are well taken care of. Any people are mad about a prison that they have built, they are going to decongest the Ghana prison service or the police station. Come on, man, y'all need to quit tripping, man. Y'all need to quit tripping. Anyway, as I said, I am happy for this feat. I hope say individual organizations and you understand. Let us help. We we the country will be the fix now. And your government no kwa bit me fix you. Individual contributions, organization contributions. Obia should play it uh, his or uh, its uh, part or whatever, so that we we'll make sure say we 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 we'll fix this country. Maybe Bia no ma sorry mo kwa bye. So, who said my changing Mrs. Pentacles for a tie? I just my master son. DJ, you're more Pentacles, please. I'm so happy. Oh,